evening, everyone. Umbawa, minasang. And welcome back to day two of our adventures on Seven Oaks Farm. Really had to hold myself back from playing um, these last few days, especially after hearing that the update came out. I've been quite excited about that. Um, it's going to be interesting to see uh, all the little tweaks and maybe little little changes here and there. I haven't seen too much about it. I've sort of not been wanting to, to spoil myself, even though I know there's nothing major. It's just little things, but um, still, I'm looking forward to, to seeing it. And to um, to continue building, building our farm, planting new crops, discovering new things. So, um, yeah, if you'd like to come along with me, I'd be very happy for your company. So let's load up, shall we? Do let me know if the sound is okay. Um, I can't make myself much louder. I'm afraid I have a very small voice, but I can make the game a little, a little quieter if need be. So just let me know. Ah, oh, it looks like the chat overlay is working, which is nice. Now, where were we? Day nine of spring. And what were we doing? I suppose we'll have to go outside to find out. Fire up. Now let's check a fortune teller. Ah, I sense that a new viewer has joined us. A young man from Stardew Valley. Welcome, welcome. The spirits are somewhat mildly perturbed today. Luck will not be on your side. Oh, it's alright, not too bad. Not too good, not too bad. Alright, so we have our little flower garden out in front. And where... there it is. There's our can, there's our axe, there's our scythe. Not sure if we'll need all of that, but... Let's grab it all anyway. While we get reacquainted with what we're doing. No, I think I have... what did I have here? I think I have some blue jazz and some tulips around the outside, don't I? For our little little garden project. I wouldn't mind expanding that a little bit actually. Oh, a couple of potatoes to harvest. Right, let's get all these watered. Got a cauliflower over there and not quite sure what the rest of you are. Reach that as we can. Some green beans. Growing nicely up their little poles. Hmm, now the ninth. So we've got plenty of time to grow things still, so let's fill in those two gaps. I suspect we have some mixed seeds lying around, so... Put those potatoes in there. Mixed seeds? Mixed... no mixed seeds? Oh no, there's mixed seeds. There they are. And also a couple of boxes of fertilizer so that whatever we plant will hopefully be something nice on there and on there and water in water in now there's nothing in our cave so no point going in there just yet Missions, missions, initiation you successfully dispatched ten slimes now you can enter the adventurers guild shall do. Forging ahead. Forging ahead. If you're going to keep mining, you should build a furnace. Ah, right. Yesterday. I think yesterday. Uh, Clint must have come by to give us those blueprints. So, with enough stone and enough copper ore. Ah, the ore might be an issue. No, it's not. We've got everything we need. Then let's craft, shall we? And we'll put that just there. Now, if we have some coal, we can start smelting. And we do. In we go. Progress, progress. We are entering the industrial era. Seven Oaks. 
Mm, no, we can put our tools away, or most of them. Now, it was a slightly bad luck day, so is it worth mining? Is it worth mining? I think I'd like to take a quick look at our skills. Now, everything's still level one, so it doesn't really matter what we do, actually. Mm, shall we do... I think we'll fish today. Let's... Mm. Ah, oh, what shall we do? Mining or fishing? Mining or fishing? Mm. Fishing is likely to be more profitable in the short term, but... Oh, these have gone to the museum already. This hasn't, though. Oh, so we can sell... sell this and this. For now. Because we'll get more. Alright, hold on. You two go in the box. I, I've decided. I'm going mining. I'm going mining. Alright, you get back in there. And just these three we will take with us. Okay. It's not a perfect day for mining, but we will go anyway. See what we can dig up. Look at the sparrows. Suzume Tachi. Ah, no, this way, this way. Good morning, Linus. Where are you off to? Have you come to ridicule me? No. I'm just minding my own business. I wouldn't do that. Least of all to you. Smelting. Now that you build a furnace, you can smelt some metal. According to Clint's instructions, if you place five copper ore and one piece of coal in the furnace, it should produce a copper bar. Well, by the time we get home, there should be one waiting for us. Uh, Adventurer's Guild is not open until two. If I remember correctly. Maybe tonight we can get a little look inside. Right, slime. Away with ye. And your friend. Anything? Mixed seeds. Good. Little piece of quartz over there. Another couple of slimes. And no need to dig. The stairs are there. Good start, promising. Oh, hello. Hello. Oh no. Nope, not dealing with you. I hate you so. I hate you so. Something better to smack things with. Oh, we've got that coal already, so don't have it a second time. That would be greedy. And down we go. This area is overrun with monsters. Not what I like to read when I've only got a rusty sword to wield, but oh no. Nope, nope, go away, go away. Back, 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 back. Get ship. Well, can I... I think I can craft a... what's it? Uh, that's a crab. That is a crab. They were not joking about this place being overrun. Uh, okay, come on, please. Thank you. 
you. Okay. Getting through them. There's another one. Plenty of combat training today. Another one? I don't know, like, oh, it's the same crab, it's just moved over there. Oh, don't like this, don't like this, don't like this, don't like this. Okay. Can't get the crab yet. Ah! Careless, careless. Oh no, no! Hate you! Hate you. Get. Go. Gone. Away. Shoo. Back. Right, so now I need to bop you. Another one? How many of these damn things? It's an infestation. Two of them! That's not... There. <laughs> we have a yam. When do yams normally come up? I think it's the autumn, isn't it? And an earth crystal. Are you... Marlin, I think this is more job for you. I don't know why I'm on pest control. This is going to take all day. It's already four o'clock. Get. Go away. Absolutely hate these. There's another one. Go. Out of here. Shoot. Come on. Die. God. Right. Are you serious? Is one of these things going to kill me? I will be so annoyed. We've killed everything that I can see. And. Yep. Really? 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 This is the worst day. This is the worst day. Hate it. Hate it. Hate it. Hate it. Leave me alone. Okay, two more duckies. Two more duckies. Two more duckies. Two more duckies. Do not die. Do not die. Do not die. Okay. No. Wrong way. Come on. Okay. So just one more... Come on, be the last one. Please be the last one. You're not the last one. How many more? Still more. Still more. Where? Where are you? Where are you? Hello? Where is... Hello? Ah. Little bugger. This is not good. I'm so low on health now. Thank the maker. Right, where? There, I see. Ah. <sighs> Well, that was terrible. Nope, I'm sick of you. One copper ore. And the flies are back. Goodbye. Oh, level 15. Well, we achieved something today. Death to bugs. Oh, not these little... Ah, oh, no, you're gonna get in your cocoon, and you're gonna... Uh... You know what? I give up. We're going home. 
This has been the worst day. Ah, Adventurer's Guild. Not that I can afford anything you're going to sell me. <sighs> Hello, Marlin. What do you have? Three to seven damage versus my... Versus my... Two to five. Iron Dirk, two to four, plus two critical. Leather boots. Nope. Nope. Mm. And this is our eradication goals. 40 out of a thousand slimes, 22 out of 80 caving six, 14 out of 30 duggies, almost halfway to the goal with them, which is something. Two out of 60 rock crabs, and who knows about the rest? Now, this out here looked different. Was there... Maybe it's just me sort of imagining things now, but was there always a waterfall up there? I don't remember that. Again, maybe I'm just sort of subconsciously looking for things and noticing things I didn't before because I know something's changed. But I don't remember that being there. Ooh, bubbles. But I don't have my rod. So there's nothing I can do about the bubbles. Hmm. Could go to the saloon. Ah, oh, it's a bit far. No, we just go home. Ah, oh, what a waste of a day. What a waste. What do we get for our trouble? Six cherry bombs. Bug meat. Piece of quartz and one miserable copper ore. I suppose it's all uphill from here. Right. Uh, seeds will go in the other one, but you, 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 you. Uh, not you. Ah, uh, seaweed shouldn't be in there. Uh, meats, bombs, copper bar, copper ore, earth crystal, geode. How many geodes? So seven geodes. Seven geodes, and we can give that to Gunter. Yeah, let's go to the museum tomorrow. Museum and blacksmith. And see what they can do for us. See what they've got for us. Meantime, let's chop. I'd like to at least make some use of our energy for the day. Mm, who else would like to come down? You, I think. Let's clear this whole patch of land. So there's you and you, finally. And that will take us just after 11pm, which is fine. Uh, we might as well... Drop some more ore in our furnace. Should have done that before I started chopping, but never mind. So, one, one, two. Has Gunter seen an earth crystal before? He has, yep. Yeah. Alright. To bed. And may tomorrow be more productive. Hmm. 80 for a topaz, 100 for an amethyst. Fair enough. Fair enough. They're not especially rare. <laughs> right. What do the spirits have to say for themselves today? I sense that a new viewer has joined us. The spirits feel neutral today. The day is in your hands. You <gasps> it's time. It's time. <laughs> I 
Hello, Rowan. You see this dog here? I do. I do. I found it sitting outside the en entrance to your farm. I think it's a stray. Poor thing. Hey, it seems to like this place. Hey, um, don't you think this farm could use a good dog? I do. Yes. Ah, uh, choose a name. Choose a name. Ah. Uh, what's good for this dog? What's a good name for this dog? Hmm. Be a good pooch now, okay? <laughs> he says he will. Let's put that in there. Reckon, where did you go? Boy, you in the house? I don't think you're in the house. Oh, you are. Good boy. <laughs> in there. Mm. Ah, watering, watering. Okay. Let's not get distracted by the dog. Even though he's a very good dog. Right. Mm, these should be up quite soon by the looks of things. Take a chance, water the tulips, and grab that bar, put it in the chest. Three of those now. Five more, and we can get our first tool upgrade, which is good. Now, just wondering among the spring seeds if there's anything we haven't grown yet, and I don't think we have any kale, so. We might get some of that before the season's over. I think that would be a good idea. A little bit might pop up among the spring, among the mixed seeds, but you never know. Now, we were going to go to the blacksmith today, where we we're going to take our seven geodes and a piece of quartz for the museum. And if we're heading down towards the sea anyway, then we might as well take our bamboo pole with us. And do a little fishing, I would say. So let's do just that. Let's head towards town and see what we can find. Clay. And purple. Ah, another one. Say sin. Hmm. Oh, it's time. It's time. Oh, hi there. What an eyesore. This is the Pelican Town Community Center. Or what's left of it, anyway. It used to be the pride and joy of the town, always bustling with activity. Now, just look at it. It's shameful. These days, the young folk would rather sit in front of the TV than engage with the community. But listen to me. I sound like an old fool. Joja Corporation has been hounding me to sell them the land so they can turn it into a warehouse. 
Pelican Town could use the money, but there's something stopping me from selling it. I guess old timers like me get attached to relics of the past. Ah well. If anyone else buys a Joja Corp, Corp, Corp membership, I'm just gonna go ahead and sell it. <sighs> Don't do that. Here, let's go inside. What's this? I guess Vincent and Jazz must have been playing in here. This place is even more dilapidated than I remember. <laughs> Hello, little friend. What? What's the matter? Are you ill? You saw something? Hmm, I wouldn't be surprised if this place was full of rats. <laughs> Little friend. You're worrying me, Rowan. Look, I think I'm gonna head home. I need some lunch. Hey, I'll keep this place unlocked from now on. Maybe you can help catch that rat if you have some extra time. That was no rat. Mayor Lewis. I'll have to come back and explore this building further. Hmm, we've got time. Oh, we're already here. Exploring we shall go. Bulletin board. Giant safe. Remains of something. Cellar growing mushrooms. Hmm. Something glowing. There you are. <laughs> you look like a nashi. Ah. Hmm. Looks like a tree of life in the background. Not much else we can glean from this, though. Loop. Hmm. I see. I see. Mysterious message. Little jelly friends. <laughs> I'm sure we'll find out more very soon. Now, where were we? It's already 10 a.m., so... We can head over to where we were going. Looks like a good day to play catch, huh? I'd ask you to throw the ball around, but you don't really seem like the sports type. Mm. You have my number, don't you? Uh, I'm fine just watching you from a distance. That sounds a little weird when you phrase it that way, but... Mm. Yeah, some people just aren't made for sports. I take no offense to that. <laughs> uh, now, where to first? First to the blacksmith. First to Clint. Crack open these geodes for us. See what's hiding inside. Coal. Copper. More copper. Whoa. 
Malachite. Mm, limestone. Oh, dwarvish helm. More malachite. All right. We'll probably put those in. Whoa, 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 whoa. Those weren't there before. Hmm. <laughs> Again, don't know if it's my mind playing tricks or there actually has been a change. Anyway, donate. Let's donate what we can. Piece of quartz. Piece of malachite. And piece of limestone. We will organize these a bit better at some point, but for now I'm just sort of putting things any which way. Now, what have you got for us, Gunter? Peach seed? No, peach. <laughs> Melon seeds. Plant these in the summer. It takes 12 days to mature. They do look like peaches. In my defense. Books. On foraging, the local woods and mountains are great places to find wild produce. A good forager will clear out any weeds, stumps, or stones from these areas, so the wild produce has plenty of space to grow. Expert foragers know the secret to cultivating wild foods so that it can be grown on the farm. Isn't that amazing? Hmm. The Fisherman, Act 1. Text. Gordia, how do you catch so many fish? For me, it takes forever. You must make the choice to become a true fisherman, and over time your fishing speed will increase. So you're saying that improving my fishing skill will make me fish faster? Correct. One day you may even learn the secret to creating your very own bobbers, improving your mastery even more. Now, be gone. <laughs> Jas, hello. Alright, hello. Um, Malachite. Oh, hello. There we go. Hey, sorry in advance if I say anything rude. I didn't get much sleep last night. Uh, what do you want? <laughs> she did warn me. And I kept prodding. No one but myself to blame for that. Oh, look at all these things. Clams. Oysters. Clams. Anything else? Anything else? More clams. Come here. Come here. Now, let's just take a little look over the other side as well. Elliot! The forest is a wonderful place. Have you been there? Mmm, I have. Anything? Clay. Nothing much interesting popping out of the ground today. So many things. I do wonder if you don't visit the beach for a few days, does the stuff build up? Or is it just a sheer matter of luck? Not sure. It can't be entirely luck. Can it? Because we don't... Today is not a lucky day. Today is just a normal... Normal neutral day. So I can't imagine we got that amount from... The spirits, but who knows? It's a bit of a mystery sometimes. The way... Things work in this... In this world. Anchovy. Anchovy. Never enjoyed anchovies very much. Again, I think I've mentioned this before at some point, but I don't like any food that involves... What on earth? What on earth? I have never seen that in my life. It's beautiful. Huh. C 
sea jelly. Do you mean a jellyfish? Oh, treasure chest, treasure chest, treasure chest. Yes, we got it. It's probably full of coal. But let's find out. Bait. Uh, can't use that for now. I should go to the shop, actually, and find out what Willy is charging for a better rod. Hmm. What would it be? A thousand gold? Maybe? Not sure. Because I would like a better rod as soon as possible. Come here. Another anchovy. Seed you. Hmm. Come on, come on. Oh, bubbles. I'll go and get those bubbles in a minute. Just want to wait until we get a bite here, but all we got was... Why did it make the sound again? That wasn't special seaweed, was it? I think it was just seaweed. Another chest, another chest. Nope, come here. Uh-oh, uh-oh, okay. Chest. Fish. Fish, get the fish. Fish, 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 fish. Sardine. What's in the chest? Coal! Of course it's coal. <sighs> Seaweed. It didn't make the funny noise that time. Hmm. Right. Fish, another treasure chest. What is going on? Right, come in. Come on in. Come on in. What are you? Sardine. And the bubbles are gone. Hmm. Alright, let's take a look in the shop. And see what's what. See what Willy has for us. And what we ought to be saving up for. Well, we ought to be saving up for a tool upgrade. That's the next most important thing, I would say. What have you got? A smallmouth bass bait, specifically. That's new. I've never seen specific bait before. Anyway, uh, what was I saying? Training rod? Ah, oh, no, that sounds terrible. Bamboo pole I already have. A fish smoker. Huh. Huh. Interesting. Fish tank. Fish tank. We can have a fish tank in our house. Oh, that's wonderful. <laughs> and a fisherman's bed. I, li <clears throat> I like that. That's good. Ah, fish tank. I'm very happy with that. I want a fish tank. I don't have one at the moment. Hello, Vincent. I want to look for bugs, but Mum gets mad when I'm all dirty. That's a tough choice. <laughs> we don't have a school here, but I'm doing my best to give Vincent and Jess a proper education. Every child deserves a chance to be successful. Jazz is very good at math and reading. Vincent is good at... Well, he has an active imagination. <laughs> I can see that. And he's interested in, uh, in things. Living things. Just like I always have been. Mm, I like that. Times have been tough lately. I got laid off my job as a bus driver. If I got that job back, I could drive you to Calico Desert. Calico Desert, man. Sam, did you watch the game last night? Or wait, do you even have a TV set? I do, thank you very much. 
Uh, do I need anything from the shop? I did mention wanting to get some kale, and it's closed. It's a Wednesday. Of course it's closed. Hi there. Do you have everything you need for the farm? If not, we might be able to help you out. We carry a variety of useful items. Hmm. But it is a Wednesday. Now, 5.30. 5.40. Do we have time to do a little bit of exploring of the forest? We do, but we ought to bring our tools with us if we're going to do that and clear some space. Now let's put this, this... Ah, oh, there's no room for these things. I need to craft a new chest for rocks and whatnot. 50 wood. Ah. 50 wood. So, uh, chest. Chest, 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 chest. Chest for rocks and stuff, which we will make grey. So, coal, clay, malachite. I don't know where to put that at all. Uh, let's see. The helm we can sell. Wood can go in there. Crystal, coal, bars, ore stone quartz all of you go in the minerals box uh huh okay do we have any more baked i don't see any uh urchins and corals go in there wait why do i have wait do i not have a I don't. Oh, that's not good. I don't have a fish box. I need to craft a fish box. I don't have the wood. Well, that's what we're doing. We are getting wood. <laughs> ah. What are you? Coal. It's always coal. It is never anything except coal. Oh, things, things, things. Horseradish. Leak. Okay, chop. We had about 18 wood, we need about 30 more. Which should be doable. Considering the amount we get from a single tree. That should do it. So let's run back. Collect up the remainder of our wood. Craft another box. Put it here. Colour it blue. 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 And this box will be for fish. And such. So. You, 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 you. You, you, you. You. And you come from the sea as well. And you. Oh, don't have room. Uh, okay. Fish. Fish goes in there. This is now the organization stream. Welcome. More minerals. You go in there. Fish. You are not fish, but you are close enough. Seaweed. Why not? All of you in here. Seeds as well. And what can I sell? I can sell you, you. Mm. Two of you. And you. Throw you in the box. In you all go. 
I don't know what to do with that jelly. I suppose... I suppose fish box for the jelly. Right, organize that. And... Yeah. Now the seeds that Gunter gave us were for the summer, were they not? So they should stay... Ah, Dorvish Helm. Sell. No use for that. Off to eBay you go. And off to bed we go. Dog. Let's put the fire on, shall we? That's better. Mm, how have we earned? Alright, not bad, not bad. I do think we could be doing better, though. Hmm. Let's see. Alright. Ah, let me just check our fortune first. Welcome to Living Off the Land. We're back again with another tip for y'all. Now listen up. Woes from crows? Sounds like you need a scarecrow. Placing a scarecrow on your farm deters crows from a pretty good distance. Make sure you protect your valuable crops. One more thing. Need a bigger backpack to hold all your stuff? Check your local general store. Oops. Already done. Spirits. Fortune teller. Ah uh, ha ha ha. Shard of knowledge from the future. The spirits are very displeased today. They'll do your best to make your life difficult. Of course they will. Why? See, my sources tell me you've been poking around inside the old community center. Why don't you pay me a visit? My chambers are west of the forest lake, in the stone tower. I may have information concerning your... Embrasmodius wizard. <laughs> I see. Intriguing. Missing. I lost my favorite axe. If you find it, please return Asa. I'm having a tough time without it. There's 250 gold in it for whoever finds the thing. Robin. Let's see. <laughs> Robin's lost axe. Robin lost her favorite axe. The last time she remembers using it, she was cutting wood south of Marnie's ranch. Okay. Meet the wizard. Of course there's a wizard in the town. Of course. You received a letter from the local wizard. He claims to have information regarding the old community center. Enter the wizard's tower. Mm. Curious sir and curious sir. What's our little garden? I thought they might be up today, but not yet. Maybe tomorrow. Now, I wonder, do we have anything to harvest? We do. One little parsnip. Let's get the rest of this done. So. So, so, so. It is a very bad luck day. According to Wellwick. So... We ought not to attempt anything with which we need fortune, so no fishing, no mining. Hmm. No fishing, no mining. And there's not likely to be much in the way of forage. What can we do? farm, I suppose. Tidy things up. It's not much fun, though. Uh, right, can away. Fishing rod away. Let's grab you and you. Ah, uh, and we could clear the forest a bit too, so it's better at least for future foraging. Don't see why not. Ah, oh, we should be smelting, that's what we should be doing. Should definitely be doing some smelting. Since we have a nice little collection of ore now. Oh, I saw you there. Hiding. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, five, ten. Two pieces of coal. Dog. Where? 
You want some water. Come here. Dog. There you go. Good boy. He's getting wagging his tail. Oh. Okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Right. Ah, some more. Lots of forage. Look at that. Never seen so much. Beak. Some horseradish. Mm -mm. Right, down you come. Some new ideas to sleep on. Oh, I think I know what that means. I think I know what that means. Is that a piece of wood? It is, yeah, just lying there. I think that means I leveled up a skill. Oh, and that's just a little way of letting you know now. I see. Look at all those seeds. Oh, new cutscene. Yeah, it smells. <laughs> Why is it locked? I want to explore the sewers. I think Gunter has the key. Professor Gunter? The man who runs the museum? Why do you think he has it? I saw a big, rusty old key fall out of his pocket one time. A creepy sewer door like this has just got to be a match for the big, rusty old key. Hmm? <laughs> oh. There's something moving around in there. Probably a rat. That's definitely the noise that rats make. <laughs> oh, now that's new. Giant tree. Giant tree. Giant trees. Multiple giant trees. Wrong one. Here we go. Scythe, scythe, scythe. Now, let's clear these away. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, but of course I'm a shitty height. Okay. Let's clear this place for foraging. Oh, that's stone. Stone, stone. Nope. Ah, oh, now since I'm here and there's not much else I can do today, I might as well drop in on M. Rasmodius. Since my path has led me here anyway. I'll just... Oh, what's that? Stone. Ah, it fell. Oh. It's only a stone. Okay. That was a damn lion. Chop the wood. Clear away the weeds. Now, oh, is there anything else to pick up down here? Now, in that cutscene... You know, it seems I was wrong about the foraging. There's plenty. <laughs> Maybe foraging isn't based on luck after all. Hmm, this is still abandoned. Down? No, there's no way down here. 
just across. And if memory serves, then somewhere around here. Somewhere around here. There it is. Good. You found the Lost Axe. Better return it to Robin. Shall do. Whether I'll get around it today or not, I'm not sure. But I surely shall. Now, let's get our spring onions. Good. Mm, nothing over there. Alright, to the tower. To the tower. day to day, huh? Oh well. I suppose actually thinking about it, because the new updates just come out, everybody and their cat is playing Stardew at the moment. So, it's to be expected. me she might prefer something a little more violent savage that she is now in we go ah oh, come in I am Rasmodius, seeker of the arcane truth. Mediary between physical and ethereal. Master of the seven elementals. Keeper of the secret chain. You get the point. And you, Rowan, the one whose arrival I have long foreseen. I'd like to show you something. Behold! Little friend. Oh, don't cry. You've seen one before, haven't you? Don't make him cry. They call themselves the Junimos. Mysterious spirits, these ones. For some reason, they refuse to speak with me. Little wonder when you treat them like that. I'm not sure why they've moved into the community center, but you have no reason to fear them. found a golden scroll written in an unknown language. Most interesting. Stay here. I'm going to see for myself. I'll return shortly. He was not joking. Found the notes. The language is obscure, but I was able to decipher it. We, the Junimo, are happy to aid you. In your return, we ask for gifts of the best. If you are one with the forest, then you will see the true nature of this scroll. Aha! 
Come here. My cauldron is bubbling with ingredients from the forest. Baby fern, moss grub, caramel top toadstool. Can you smell it? Here, drink up. Let the essence of the forest permeate your body. aren't I? Ah, it's all going green. No wonder. Toadstool? You drank toadstool? What do you expect? But to see floating trees. Don't drink toadstools. You've gained the power of forest magic. Now you can decipher the true meaning of the Junimo scrolls. I see. <laughs> mm. Brave or stupid? That's your call. There's actually a lot of wild food in this area, if you know where to look. I've been finding it. Quite a lot of it today, actually. Now, what time is it? It's 5 p.m. Uh, we've got time to put things away, sort things out, and then let's visit the community center and take a look. Take a look at those scrolls, eh? Yeah, green box. Right, all things green go in here. Sort, get sorted out, right. You can go, you can go. Actually, let's keep that. You can go, you can go. One, two, three of you can go. No rest we will hang on to. So, you, 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 and you. And the rest we keep for now. You all go in there. Acorns in there, no fish. Ah, seeds. Seeds go in the green box. Got quite a lot. And yeah, let's head up to the community center and we might have time to go and return this to Robin. I dare say, on our way. I think her house is quite close by. Let's see what the Junimos have to say for themselves. Right, in we go now. The scroll was down here. Ah, little Nashi friend. <laughs> Right, crafts room, reward, bridge repair. Bridge repair, bridge repair. Ah, uh, by the Adventurer's Guild. Spring foraging. We've got all of these things. Construction. Hardwood, stone, wood. Don't think we have that much wood, that's for sure. Fall foraging. Summer foraging. Winter and exotic. Hmm. I see. A well, spring foraging we can we can fill that in right away. 
Well, that's the only one, but it's one anyway. So we'll do that. Well, we'll see what time we have. We could even do that tonight. First, I want to go and find Robin. She should be in her home at this hour. Oh, there she is. Demetrius. How's the farming business going? It's parsnip season, isn't it? It is. I can imagine it being pretty peaceful working outdoors with plants all day. Hmm, I'd say so. Robin. Hey, you found my axe. What a relief. I almost chopped my toe off with the other one I was using. Thank you. You are welcome. Now, run along home and get... Dandelion, Daffodil, Leek, Horseradish, Horseradish, Horseradish. There's an echo in here. Da, 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 da. Dog. Where are you, dog? Ah, oh, there you are. Why are you sleeping out here? It's getting dark. Go in the house. Ah, those go in the box. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Oh, we're out of ore already? Well, we have five bars at least, so that's enough to do something. Now, we wanted daffodil, a dandelion, and a leek. Good. Now, how much stone do we have? Ah, oh, stone is in that box too. Stone. Ah, oh, we have enough stone to put in that thing. At least. Ah. Uh, okay. Not enough wood. What about hardwood? We don't have any hardwood at all. I see. All right. Well, that'll do. That'll do for a start. We'll get there, get back, get to bed. Gosh, I've been playing for over an hour and uh, only on day 11. We started on Tuesday. <laughs> Quite a lot going on, I suppose. Quite a full couple of days. Right then. So, spring foraging. Daffodil. Horseradish. Leek. Dandelion. Bundle complete. Rewards. 30 spring seeds. Right. We've got some planting to do. Oh, he's taking his little tribute. And there's a new one. <laughs> and another for the fish tank. Oh. Now, this one is... The pantry. Spring crops. Okay. Potato. Cauliflower. Green bean. Parsnip. Well, our green beans haven't... Uh, haven't given us a harvest yet, but when they do, we'll also be able to complete this, I believe. Wait, no. No, no. Cauliflowers take at least 12 days to grow, I believe. But we definitely have one or two in the ground. Now, animal bundle. Artisan bundle. Oh, that's, that's a lot. Ah, uh, fruit. Fruit trees. I want a fruit tree. Quality crops. Five gold star parsnips. I don't think we have that many. I don't think so. Summer crops. Fall crops. Right, okay. Well, we'll be able to do the spring crops bundle at least as soon as we get our first harvest of green beans. So that's good. Now, fish bundle. River fish. Specialty fish, ocean fish, lake fish, crab pots, and night fishing. I see, I see. Ocean fish? 
We definitely have sardines, that's for sure. Don't think we have any of the rest of these, though. Robin's lost axe. 250 gold. Itadakimasu. Okay. Oh, it's dark. Okay. Home. Home, James. Thirty seeds, gosh. Okay. We definitely have some gardening to do. Now, once again, if memory serves, these spring seeds all give rise to wild crops. The four types of forage. So, hold on. Yeah, what am I doing with this? Ah, oh, we do have a cauliflower there. Okay. Right. Uh, dog. And bed. Right, one moment. Okay. Right, yeah, so we did love lot. Level 3 Foraging Axe Proficiency Cookout Kit. I have never seen before. That's new to me. As is moss soup, for that matter. Moss soup? Can you make soup out of moss? Not something I've ever heard of, but it does sound delicious. And is that a recipe or a crafting? It's a crafting recipe, isn't it? Bookseller. Bookseller is in town today. Huh. Crafting recipe cookout kit. Use this to create a cooking campfire, allowing you to cook on the go. Now that's interesting. Text sign. What was that other thing? It's completely gone from my head. Moss soup. Oh, maybe it was a cooking recipe after all. Recipes. Huh. Fortune teller, welcome back to Wellwick's Oracle. If you seek hidden knowledge of the future, well, you've come to the right place. The spirits are very displeased today. They will do their best to make your life difficult. Hello, Stone Sorrow. Nice of you to come. Dear Rowan, tomorrow we're holding the Egg Festival in the town square. You should arrive between 9am and 2pm if you'd like to attend. You wouldn't want to miss the annual egg hunt. Mayor Lewis. Ah, the daffodils, not the daffodils. It's the opposite of daffodils. The tulips are up. All the same colour, which is slightly disappointing, but never mind, they look quite pretty nonetheless. No! Oh my god. I'm quite upset with them. Well, now they've all got to come out. Now they've all got to go. Oh my god. Well, we're buying new seeds today. Apparently. Speaking of seeds, we have all those ones that the Junimos gave us yesterday, which ought to be planted. The green beans have yet to grow, so we can't do that bundle. But these can go back in here. And 
good seed. Got a lot of mixed seeds, which can be planted anytime. So I think I'll prioritize the spring seeds since we've only got we've only got eight eighteen days roughly. Now, there's a certain seed that I know I can get at the egg festival tomorrow, which I think will actually look quite pretty here, so I'm gonna save those spaces for that. Meanwhile. Fertilizer. There it is. Okay. Spring seeds. So let's fill in these gaps here, 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 and here. And we're going to have to cut down some of this. Make some space over here. Right. Back, back, back. Out of the way. Dog. Where are you, dog? There you are, dog. There you go. Good boy. <laughs> right, let's get a watering. This is going to take up most of our energy for today, I think, actually. I hear you, dog. What do you want? What? what are you barking at? Now we've got 25 left, so let's see. It's one, two, three, four, five. Wait, can I count? One, two, three, four, five. Yes, I can. Two, three, five. One, two, three, four. Five and one, two, three, four, five. Now fertilize these. Do we need another scarecrow? We might. We might just need another one to protect these, because it would be quite a shame if any got eaten. Right, you go on there. Uh Okay. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Okay. And I'll put one more row. Hold on. That's one, two, three, four. Okay. Back, 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 back. Shoot. Let's till this soil here. these in. Won't bother fertilizing all of them. It's all right. Ah, uh, this is going to be a lot of watering for the next few days. It's okay. It's okay. Ah. Is it really? Oh, a leak. It's mine. Ah, there was a message about the bookseller being in town. Now, I haven't seen them before. I'm quite curious about who they are. So, let's go and see. Uh, that leak can go straight in the... Doing my nightly rounds, and I noticed your first parsnip was ready. Congratulations! Ah, I sense you've been spending some time in the old community center. It's good to know someone's taking care of the place. A bit weird that you know the smell, but anyway. Evelyn, 
Homegrown tulips make for a lovely springtime gift. Ah, you like tulips, don't you? Well, I know what you're getting. Bookseller, bookseller, where is the bookseller? It's a fine looking day. On days like this, I like to help Evelyn with the public gardens. She's strong for her age, but I think, she, I think she appreciates all the help she can get. Hmm. I'm not seeing any books, other. Are they in here? I don't think so. You know what? One moment. I'm going to look this up because I don't want to miss them. So let's see. Stardew Valley. Book seller. Where are they? Northeast part of Pelican Town. Northeast. Somewhere? Up here, surely. North, east. Uh, up here? Oh, there's something up here. There wasn't before. Oh. Look at that. What do you have? Oh my word. Nothing that I can afford. <laughs> the Book of Stars. Read this to gain some experience in all skills. Combat Quarterly. Mining Monthly. Stardew Valley Almanac. Way of the Wind. Horse, the book. Old oh, Slitherlegs. <laughs> oh, these are great. Price catalog. Oh, now that's interesting. Yet another thing to save up lots of money for. Oh no. <laughs> ah. Oh well. Now, since we're in town, let's drop into the beach. See if anything's washed up. Oh, I'm do a patch of worms here. Starfish. Alright, can turn that into the museum. Hmm. Oh, a piece of coral will clam up there. It's funny, they call them clams, but these look like the... There's a chewy little guy in there. <laughs> I see. They look uh, like what I would recognize as scallops. Actually, these. Clams are sort of smaller, rounder, little brown things, no? Ah, oh, museum, museum, museum. Ah, uh, hello. Oh no, Mom's making lentil soup tonight. Yeah, I like lentil soup. I'll eat it if you don't. I don't know you. Yes, you do. If you dig in the dirt, you can find some interesting things. One time I found a really old piece of pottery. I brought it to Gunter and he said it was over a thousand years old. Surprised they don't have Stardew Valley Battle Royale. <laughs> the modders think of most things, so I wouldn't be surprised if that is a thing somewhere. I know there's a Stardew Valley sort of murder mystery, sort of a like a horror mod that people have made for this game. I haven't tried it, but um. 
and I've heard of its existence. The food at Jojo Mart might not be the healthiest for my family, but with such low prices, you'd be crazy to shop anywhere else. Hmm. Don't you have work to do? Nah, eh, not really. I'm self-employed. Robin has a hot temper. It's better to stay on her good side. Don't tell her I said that. Typical redheading. Eh? Hey, I heard that Lewis showed you around the community center. It'd be great if you could fix that place up. It used to be a really nice building. Doing my best. Hey, what's up, farmer guy? Oh, I almost forgot. It's my day for doing push-ups. Every time I do push-ups, I try to do one more than last time. Pretty cool strategy, huh? Hmm. Oh, there's a little poster up there to show you where he is. I see. And I suppose it's only there on the days when he visits. Ah, am I late for the shop again? I'm late for the shop again! Ah, no kale seeds today. Maybe tomorrow. Ah, uh, tomorrow's the egg festival, though. Tomorrow's the egg festival, and I don't have a whole lot of money. Well, I'll just have to be judicious with my spending. In that case... Mm, right, you... You go here. Anything I could sell. Sell you. Sell you. And you. You two. Uh, plus you and you. Uh, I'll keep you for Evelyn and sell you. And you. So, all of that in the box, and that should earn us just a little bit more pocket money for the festival tomorrow. Now, since we've got a little spare energy, I'll just take down one of these trees. This one's a little bit in the way, so this will do. Here, since we're going to be expanding into this area a bit more. So we should clear out the trees. Trees and the weeds and such. Oops. One more and I think that'll be about our limit. Oh, we can get those logs though. Okay, All right. Get you, get you. I was going to make another Scarecrow, wasn't I? And I think the ingredients for that were... Fiber. Wood and... Fiber, wood and coal, I believe. There we go. Okay. That's good. Fiber would go back in there, coal goes back in there. Ah. So, festival is tomorrow, day after tomorrow. I think it's time we got back in the mines, because we really need some more ore. He's a good boy. Right, sleep. Seven hundred eleven gold. Okay, that gets us up to over two thousand. <laughs> right. Let's see. Welcome back to Wellwick's article. Spirits somewhat mildly perturbed. Okay, we can live with that. Oh, look at the jazz. 
Now do not pick them. Leave them where they are. I've got a parsnip. Parsnip, and we're going to put. Let's see. Oh, we planted all the spring seeds. That's good. Okay. So we'll just put another mixed seed in there. There we go. And get it all watered. Those beans take a while, don't they? Now, I'm not sure when I planted them, but they seem to be taking a while. In. Ah, out of water already. And we water the dog. There we go. That's a good boy. Hello, lad. <laughs> uh, he reminds me of a dog that. That's why I like that one. He reminds me of Leo. I miss Leo. Passed away last year. Hmm, Leo was one of my whippets back home. The only boy we ever had. All the rest were girls, always. Right, that's all the watering done. But he was much the same colour as Bracken here. will be starting shortly. We have two and a half thousand to spend on it, which is good. We might be able to afford the things we want. I think festival has begun. All right, let's go. Anything to forage up here? Nothing. 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 You got strawberry seeds. There they are. Colorful set. Pastel banner. Decorative pitchfork. A thousand gold for a decorative pitchfork. Not even a useful pitchfork. Right, now, if I spend all of my earthly wealth on strawberries, I can get what? Let's get what we can. Mm, more. Yeah, let's get 20. That's good. Got 20 of those and... We can wait. I, I would like to buy these seasonal plants, but they can wait. They can wait. Yeah, it's fine. Oops, my hand slipped. <laughs> Oh no. No one really talks to me. I just come for the deviled eggs. <laughs> I don't think I've ever had deviled, e de blah, deviled eggs. Is strawberry profitable? Uh, reasonably. Reasonably. And I, I like strawberries. Our hands have been working overtime to prepare, blah, to prepare for this festival. They deserve the best tonight. Bowls full of sweet yellow corn. Did you know, if you feed a white chicken or a white duck on almost nothing but corn, they turn yellow? It's true. Is there any more food? Flint, how much food do you need? There's tables and tables of it. 
I hope everyone's enjoying the food. I've been cooking for days to get everything ready. Fried eggs, boiled eggs, poached eggs, deviled eggs, scrambled eggs, chocolate eggs. You name it. <laughs> Let's see. Vincent loves this festival. It's a joy to see him so happy. Emily. I've been up since dawn coloring eggs. It's always my favorite part of the season. What do you mean chocolate egg you? Chocolate eggs are great. Mmm, this fruit punch is unusually good. <laughs> Taking breaks from work can make you more productive in the long run. True. Very true. Welcome to the Egg Festival. Compliments of my wonderful brood of hens. <laughs> egg. What a strange thing to eat. Mmm. When you... Don't think about it too much, Demetrius. Eggs definitely have a place in the well-balanced diet. Oops, I should take off my doctor's hat for the time being. Hmm. What do they call that? Occupational hazard? Work brain? This festival has been a tradition for as long as I can remember. Tradition connects us with both the past and the future. It's comforting. Granny, you are so right. What's everyone so happy about? Hmm. <laughs> Why eggs? <laughs> ah, it's the spring. They're a symbol of birth, new beginnings and such. Something like that. Spring's a busy time of year, so it's nice to have a day off to catch up with friends. Abby's always loved the egg hunt, ever since she was a tiny girl. Ah, uh, she wins every year. Even with my bad leg. I never miss a town festival. <laughs> You'll have to tell me the story of that leg one day, Marvin. Yeah, <laughs> I put something nice into the punch. Shh, that's just between you and me, kid. Oh, no wonder Leo was enjoying it. Jazz. I hope I can find some eggs before Vincent takes them all. It's not Vincent you have to worry about. When does the egg hunt start? I'm so excited! <laughs> the children have been looking forward to this festival for weeks. I always look forward to these gatherings. It makes the valley feel like a real community. Hmm. Oh, there's you three, up to no good. This festival's alright, but what I'm really looking forward to is the flower dance. I try to eat at least three eggs every day. I need that protein for my legs. <laughs> I had three eggs this morning. Sometimes I'll hide an egg too well and no one finds it. Well, until summer rolls around, then the hot air starts to bring out the rotten smell. Lovely. Alright, I think it's everyone except for the cool kids down here. Sam? Oh, my nose. Allergies. Ah, uh, hay fever, huh? Oh. We used to do a rotten egg toss. Mayor Lewis put an end to that pretty quick. <laughs> Can't imagine why. Searching for eggs is like going on a treasure hunt. <laughs> okay, now that's everyone, I think. Let's get going. Do you think everyone's ready for the egg hunt yet? Let's go. It's time for the highlight of today's festivities. The annual spring egg hunt. Calm down now, kiddos. You're going to need all your energy if you hope to find the most eggs and take home the exclusive prize. Now, is everyone ready? Let the egg hunt begin. 
All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, I see one. Okay, one. Abigail. Not this year. Not again. Okay, see one in here. And there's one down by the tree. And there's one down by the fence here. Okay, we're on six. Uh, 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 uh. Yep, one here. Bush. Uh, there's one here. It's, oh, we're doing so well. We're doing so well. Okay, can I get around here? Yep. We go ten eggs. I think this is the best I've ever done. <laughs> ah, I see one down there. Ah, oh, but there's no time. Okay, ten eggs. I think we'll win with ten eggs. If we don't, if we don't, I'm calling Pal. Wow, look at all these eggs. Now, if only I could get you kids to pick up litter this efficiently, we'd have the cleanest town this side of the Gem Sea. <laughs> and now, the winner of this year's egg hunt. Rowan, it had to be. Here's your prize. Enjoy. I got a hat. I got a hat. <laughs> All right. Well, that's it for this year's egg festival. Thanks for coming, everyone. Straw hat. six strawberries. Why did I do this? I don't have any sprinklers. Why did I do this? Uh, well, it's another hard day on the farm tomorrow. <laughs> oh no. Greetings, it is I, the Queen of Sauce, here to teach you a new mouth-watering recipe from my secret cookbook. This week's dish? Coleslaw. Envisioning bland mounds of limp cabbage? You're not alone. But a great coleslaw can be so much more. Make sure you have juicy fresh cabbage for this one. Toss with a little vinegar and mayonnaise and you're all set. Ah, that's crispy. You learned how to cook coleslaw. Fortune teller. No, I don't care what the fortune teller has to say because I doubt we're leaving the property. Dear Rowan, how are you doing, sweetie? I've missed you so much since you left. I hope the farming life is everything you hoped for. Love, Mom. P.S. I sent your favorite cookies. Yay. Let's go in there. Water in the can. And let's get our many, 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 many seeds. We have 29 seeds to plant today. Alright. You go in there. And we carefully water these without pulling up the jazz. Okay, there we go. Dog. Good boy. Ah, is that ready to. Yes, it is. Good. Uh, now, hold on. Let's make some more fertilizer. Have some sap. Make some fertilizer. There we go. Lots and lots and lots of it. Okay, put the sap back. Put that in there. Do we still not have any harvest from those beans? They're taking their time. We'll go in there. And uh, let's get watering. Carrot seeds, eh? I'm making more new discoveries than I expected today. Into our 
my spring seeds. Why did I buy that many strawberries? Why did I do that? It's gonna take forever. But, when everything is grown, and harvest time rolls around, we're gonna make a lot of money. So, worth it. I promise. Maybe. Now, let's beat back this edge out a bit. Because I know you like to encroach on my fields. Now, uh, let's see, I think over here is where we can put our strawberries. I know there's that log in the way, but we'll work around it. Now we have, let's see, 23. One for the carrots and 22 for the strawberries. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three. Okay, there we go. Now, fertilize all of this. Oh, Mr. Spot. Okay. Carrot. And the rest shall be our strawberry fields. Forever. Strawberry fields. Work ever. There we go. Okay, now. Uh, that song's going to be in my head now. going to be so much work in the mornings. I don't think I even know how to craft sprinklers yet, and even if I did, things are already planted. It's too late. Still, it looks quite nice, doesn't it? You know, it looks productive. Those are all watered there. How to win friends. Giving gifts is a great way to build friendships. Learn each person's individual tastes, and you'll be popular in no time. Hmm. Ah, I know one thing that one person would like. Tulip. Or... Granny. Now, is there anything else we would like to do? Oh, maybe... I mean, maybe just visit the forest. We'll go to town, find Evelyn. Ah, uh, take a look up here. There we go. Daffodil. Season. Now, where would she be? Either at home or in the flower beds, I assume. Okay, she's not here. Try in their house. There she is. No! <laughs> Alex, no! That wasn't for you! <laughs> but I'm glad you liked it, I suppose. That was for your grandma. <laughs> Damn it. Evelyn. Um, Daffodil? Oh my, it looks wonderful. It's very kind of you. I had something better. It's nice to be so close to the ocean. The sound of the sea makes going to sleep a lot easier. As kids, we hunted for seashells after the tide went out. 
those were the days. Ah. Give me my money. Alex, that was horrible timing. Ah, lost book. Good. And clam. Mm, all right. Sunday, Sunday. Sam, everyone's here. Goodness. Okay. Ugh, I stepped in something gross earlier. I just bought these shoes. Sorry to hear that, mate. tell anyone, but I snuck into the community center last night. I think it's haunted. Do you see them too? Abigail, do you see them too? <laughs> I mean, if anyone in this town... Good. Might be her. If you hear any banging from inside my hut, it's probably just me working on one of my sculptures. No comment. I don't see anything. Nothing. Not a sausage. Huh. Now, it being a Sunday, there might be a certain person waiting for us near the entrance to the forest. But, given the fact that we have no money, their presence or lack thereof, it makes no particular difference. Well, let's go see if they're here anyway, and they are. Let's do some window shopping. Coconut, ice cream, grape, radish, spice, berry, strawberry. If I could sell every single strawberry that I harvested for 800 gold. Ah. Roots, platter, shrimp, cocktail. Snow yam, juice. Armchair. Oh, I would like that armchair. It's not even expensive. A red fence. <laughs> Let's see. Hmm. All right. More seeds, more seeds. We really need sprinklers. I should check actually, can I craft them? I cannot yet. Dog? What's up, dog? Hello. You're in the way with the furnace. Not that I'm using it. Uh, let's see. You, you. You. You in there. No, nope, not you. There. And you in there. Right, it's 5.20, but there's not much else on the agenda. So, let's get to bed. Now... One more day. It's raining. Ah, please let our fortune be good. Wilwick. Ah, yes. I can hear the spirits whispering something to me. The spirits feel neutral today. The day is in your hands. I will take neutral. 
Welcome to Living Off the Land. We're back again with another tip for y'all. Now listen up. It's salmonberry season. All across the countryside, bushes are teeming with juicy little berries, and they're free for the taking. Harvesting them is a great way to earn some extra cash. Well, I shall pick up some... Oh, and that saves us from the watering. Thank everything. Hello, dear. I know you're just getting started as a gardener, so I wanted to give you a little tip. Most crops only grow in one season. When summer arrives, your spring crops will all die out. So plan ahead. Granny Edwin. Thank you, Granny. So helpful. Even though I could only give you a mere daffodil. Uh, no, I don't need my watering can. Don't need my axe. And uh, don't need my scythe. Do need my sword. Uh, now we will quickly buzz around and pick up what salmon berries we can. Anything here? Nothing. Nothing, nothing. I do hope these brown ones aren't dead. I, f I feel they should not look like that, but, well, let's see. Uh, no. Any more? Any more? Any more bushes? Okay, let's hurry up and get to the mine. I'm sure there'll be one or two more berry bushes along the way that we can raid. A leek. And a reddish. Horseradish. Ah, if we see Linus, I'll give him one of those vegetables, I think. He might be in his tent since it's raining. Oh, come here. Linus? There you are. I have brought you... No. I brought you... A leak? No. Give it to him. That's a good find. I'm always happy when eating wild food. Thank you. The crisp air of the wilderness is all I care to know. I live out here by choice. But why? Five salmon berries and a horseradish. We'll keep those close at hand in case we need some extra energy in the mines. I don't know. I'm feeling optimistic about this. And my optimism has been immediately dis uh, uh, dissipated, dashed, destroyed, decimated by the appearance of these horrible, horrible little grubs. Please. Please give me a sword today. Anything better than this. There's more of them. Alright. If we get underneath them... No, don't split them up. Don't split them up. No, kill it, kill it, kill it. Kill it. Okay, good, good, good. Not that it mattered anyway. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, I see you. Ah, marine. That's new. Good. And some ore. Nope, nope. Buzz off. Go. Wait. Shoot. One. Be gone. Be gone. Be gone. Help. Okay, good. Let's see, let's see. Anything over here? Ah. A little more ore. And the staircase. Good. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, no, no. Oh, this is not a good time. Don't tell me we're doing this again. Go! Okay. Let's just try and find the exit as soon as possible. Okay, good. Nope. Nice try.
front. This is level 19, so... Um, go. Okay, I'll deal with you first. Oh! Never mind. Ah, but I want to see what's in the interior. Can we... Ah! I think we just leveled up our combat. That's good. Um, okay. Slime. Come on. Come on. Oh, I can't... Ah, oh, I can't get around here. Ah, uh, there's probably a new weapon in the middle, but... Uh. Alright. Down we go. Oh, there we go. That's better. You received a steel small sword. Four to eight, plus two. Well, it's an improvement. We'll take it. Take it gladly. Okay, and I can sell the old one with the guild when we leave. Anything in here? Nothing. It's all right. Piece of quartz. A little ore. Hmm. Oh gosh. Ah, uh, that's a bit faster. Good. 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 today. Should be good. But I dare say we will. Oh, not that one. This one. Okay. Nothing up here. Nothing at all. Okay. Let's head downstairs. Darker. It's more difficult to see what we're doing. Ah, nope, leave me be. I was minding my own business. Crap. And if you'd minded yours, you would still be in one piece. Say the same of you. Thank you for the crystal. Ah, and there's our way down. Anything... Anything to pick up? Ooh, look at all this. What have we got? Anything interesting? Fertilizer, more carrot seeds. A glow ring. Oh, perfect. Glow ring. dark levels. Mm, nothing much to be found here. Oh, it's 5pm, but we've got plenty of energy still, so I think we'll carry on down. If we can find our way. Let's 
Ah, geode, good. Mm. Let me right out of the way. More copper, more copper. 34, 35 pieces. Which will give us, what, seven bars. Grubs. I hate the grubs. Oh no, 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 don't do that. a little less annoying than before. Get out of my way. Oh, oh you're backed up into a corner. More's the pity for you. Two staircases. Oh, are we full up? We are indeed. Now let's get rid of... Ah, uh, what do we not need? What do we not need? Sap? Yeah. How's the time? Eight, almost 8 p.m. All right. Ah. Be gone. Now, where does this go? And is there anything at the end of it? There is coal. Why is it always coal? Ah, hold on. If I'm quick... If I'm quick and lucky... I might make it to level 30. But I know how this goes. As soon as you say things like that, your luck evaporates with miraculous speed. Also, I don't have much energy left. I've got a few berries I can top up with, but not, not too many. And this is quite a big level. this. Anything interesting here? Coal, geode, more ore. Ah. Come on. Right, let's eat something. A couple of berries. I told you, didn't I? This would be the moment our luck mysteriously runs out. Uh, what shall we throw? We don't have much of that slime. Uh, that. Ah, come on. Come on. There we go. Okay. Good. Good. Ah, the guild's shut now, though. Guild closes at 10, unfortunately, but that's all right. Not as if that sword is worth very much. Now, that was a good day's mining. 42 pieces of copper ore, aquamarine, some geodes. Perfectly happy with that. Now, let me see. Get all of this sorted out. And then we'll wrap up for today. So let's see. Fiber. Mm, bomb. Fertilizer. Bug meat. Da, 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 da. Sword. 
breast almost goes in the minerals box. Oh, what a good day. And the rest of you go not in the fish box, you go in the green box. What a good day. Plant in the spring. Ah, I suppose I could. I've got time. Alright, I've got time. One box of fertilizer. Carrot seed. And let's pop you just here. There. Since you are so quick to grow. Yes, yes, I know. It's getting late. It's getting late. One, two, three, four, five. One. Four. Into the furnace. And to bed we go. Dog. And to bed. Ah, level two combat. I should think so. Plus five HP. New recipe. Life elixir. Level 2 Mining, Pickaxe Proficiency, Crafting Recipe Staircase. Oh, we made no money that day. Never mind. <laughs> oh well. Oh well, I'm glad that was a bit of a productive day for the last one of the stream. That's good. Happy with that. We've made some good progress on the farm. Our fields have certainly expanded. <laughs> it's going to give us a lot more work to do for a few days, but that's all right. There'll be some good profits lying at the end of it. The uh, pot of gold at the end of the rainbow, so to speak. So, it's all going well. And now we've got our bundles unlocked, which is great. It feeds the hoarder within me. Uh, yeah, the story is getting underway. Uh, thank you so much for everyone who joined this evening. Very much appreciated. And uh, I'll see you probably quite soon next stream. Now, let's see. Have somewhat of a busy day tomorrow, but not in the evening. So there's a possibility uh, that I'll be continuing our adventures tomorrow evening. Um, I will, as usual, um, update you on that on my Twitter, so feel free to follow me there if you'd like to uh, stay up to date on that. And uh, yes, thank you once again. I hope to see you next time. Good night. <laughs>